Back on how to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here. From what we have here, can factor 3 raised to the power x out, and what we have becomes 3 raised to the power x into brackets 1 plus 1 plus 1, then equals to 16 from here. That is, here we have 3 raised to the power x times 3 equals to 16 on this side. And next step here, we divide both side by 3. Divide this side by 3, and divide this side by 3. 3 cancelled each other here. Then what we have left becomes 3 raised to the power x equals to 16 over 3 here. The next step, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 3 raised to the power x equals to log 16 over 3. That is from here, we apply the power law of logarithm when we have log m raised to the power p, the same thing as p log m. Then what we have here becomes x log 3 equals to log 16 over 3. That is, here we divide both sides by log 3. Divide this side by log 3. Also, divide this side by log 3, which implies here log 3 cancel each other. And we have x left, which is equal to log 16 over 3, then divided by log 3. Then from what we have here, this follows from the law of logarithm. When we have log a over b, this can be written as log a minus log b. That is what we have here follow this and becomes x equals to log 16 minus log 3 over log 3. Then from here, we separate this into two fractions, and what we have becomes x equals to log 16 over log 3 minus log 3 over log 3. Then here, log 3 cancel each other. We have one left, which implies what we have becomes x equals to log 16 over log 3 minus 1 and next step here 16 can be written as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 which is 2 raised to the power 4 and what we have becomes x equals to log 2 raised to the power 4 over log 3 minus 1 then when we apply the power law of logarithm 4 comes here and what we have becomes x equals to 4 log 2 over log 3 minus 1 here. Then applying change of base here from when we have log a over log b, which can be written as log a to base b. Then what we have becomes x equals to 4 times log 2 base 3 minus 1. So here we have the value of x in this given problem as 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1. Now let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute the value of x which is x equals to 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1. And what we have here becomes 3 raised to power 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1 plus 3 raised to power 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1 then plus 3 raised to power 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1 is equals to 16 
on this side then from what we have here we are adding same thing together similar to when we have a times a plus a plus a which can be written as 3a so this are similar thing added together so we can say this is 3 times 3 raised to power 4 log 2 is 3 minus 1 is equal to 16 from here that is yeah we apply the law of indices also when we have a raised to power m minus n this same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n at this year we have three times three raised to power four log two is three then over three raised to power one is it equals to 16 from here then three raised to power one same thing as three that is here three cancel each other we are left with three raised to power four log two is three is it equals to 16 on this side that is from here we reverse this four from power law when we have p log m the same thing as log m raised to power p that is here yeah, this becomes 3 raised to power log 2 raised to power 4 is 3 is it equals to 16 on this side that is the same thing as 3 raised to power log 2 raised to power 4, that's 16, then base 3 is equal to 16 here. And also, what we have here follows when we have a raised to power log b base a, which is equal to b. Then what we have here follow this, and this becomes 16, which is equal to 16 here. Now we have the left hand side equals to the right hand side. And hence from here, we can conclude that x equals to 4 log 2 base 3 minus 1 satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching us here at Master T Math Class. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up and put your comment. And also join our membership package for access to more our video and exclusive text and thank you see you next class and bye for now